you sit down and do nothing, then you know it's like like seeing a lion coming down 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 the road, and you say, you know what? Here, just eat me. I'm not gonna be eaten. No way. I'm, you know, and, and nobody who works with me is gonna be eaten. We're ready to, to 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 meet challenges as they come, as hard as they come, as depressing as they may be, and we're gonna work to make sure that we pass that obstacle. So the, the name of my company is Adventure Antigua and um, I started it in 1999 and it was essentially um, uh, a new type of, of tour. Up until then it was all booze cruise type catamaran tours here in Antigua um, and I wanted to provide an alternative to that so more of a sort of eco-historical type adventure tour with snorkeling, sightseeing and, uh, and, and visiting places off the beaten track. I don't know how long this is going to go on for. This plot of land is supposed to be a tourism development, you know? It's supposed to be a villa or, or apartments or whatever else. Not, not a farm. But right now, there ain't no tourists coming here and we need to eat. So that's the idea. You have a qualified captain. Um, who is usually driving this boat with 22 yelling and super happy tourists shoveling manure. So, you know, it's everybody's, tourism is everybody's business if there's tourism. If there's no tourism, then, you know, everybody's business is looking after ourselves and our families and our communities and the circles that sort of go out from there. And, you know, nobody should be left, um, should be left to be hungry. So, right now, it's about making sure that nobody's hungry. You know, that's, that's priority number one. If you're a boat operator, then you can start fishing. You know, and uh, so, you know, going to the fisheries office and, and trying to figure out how you can get into some sort of sustainable method of fishing. But also, at the same time, you know, keep sending out some positive news out there. You know, don't let people forget Antigua. At the end of the day, you know, we want to, our tourism is our business. This is, that's what we're in. Um, we want to we we take people and show them the beautiful island that we call home. I mean, that's why we got into this business. So, you know, if we're going to continue doing that, we must get our head around the reality that it's not going to be business as usual. Maybe it will mean us working harder and receiving less. And I mean, you know, that's, that's a possibility. You got to try something. <laughs> I mean, you know, sitting down and, and just waiting for for, for plain loads of tourists to come back here makes me feel very helpless and um, I will do everything I can to get those tourists back to Antigua you know I'll show them the beautiful beaches the wonderful reefs and everything else but you know while we wait for that day we still have to be feeling confident that food is going to be on the table <laughs>